I bet you didn't know we might actually hear from aliens in our lifetime. With every new discovery in astronomy, the possibility grows more real. Imagine, somewhere out there, a distant civilization could be sending signals, hoping someone is listening. The universe is vast, and we're just beginning to tune in. But if we do get a message, should we text back? Should humanity answer the cosmic call, or stay silent and just listen? It's a question that sparked heated debates among scientists, philosophers, and everyday people alike. It's a bigger question than you'd think, this isn't just about curiosity, it's about the future of our species, and the risks and rewards that come with making contact. Some scientists say yes, sending a reply, could unite humanity like never before. Imagine the world coming together, setting aside differences, to craft a message that represents all of us. It could be a moment of unprecedented global cooperation. It might be our chance to learn, share and connect with a whole new kind of life. We could exchange knowledge, ideas, and maybe even discover new ways to understand the universe and ourselves. But others warn that answering could expose us to risks far beyond our control. What if the civilization we contact isn't friendly? What if we reveal too much about ourselves or attract attention we're not prepared for? After all, we have no idea who or what is listening. The unknown can be both exciting and terrifying. And history has shown that first contact between civilizations doesn't always go well. One message could change our religion, our philosophy, even the way we see ourselves. It could challenge everything we believe about life, the universe, and our place in it. Are we ready for a conversation that could reshape our world? Are we prepared for the consequences, both good and bad, of reaching out into the cosmic dark? The universe may not be silent. Somewhere, a signal could already be on its way, crossing the vastness of space toward us. The real question is, are we ready for the echo? When the call comes, will we have the courage and the wisdom to answer?